Hey, good morning everyone. Mark Nicholson coming to you from Larkins GMC in Toma, Wisconsin. As if we didn't have an excellent lineup of new GMC 1500 Sierra trucks already. All those in the front row there are new. We've got another one to walk through this morning that just arrived. 2024 GMC Sierra 1500 Denali. Exterior color is sterling metallic. Interior is jet black leather. This has got the 3.0 turbo diesel engine with the 10 speed transmission. And this one's kind of special because it's got the Denali Reserve Super Cruise package on it. So this one's got the Super Cruise on it. And that's what you see on TV and they're advertising that uh, uh, under certain circumstances, the vehicle will drive for you. You're still in control of that vehicle, but uh, you can take your hands off the steering wheel and it'll drive for you. So going through this vehicle, again, this is a 2024. Vehicles with diesel engines, they come with a three-year, 36,000-mile bumper-to-bumper warranty and a five-year, 100,000-mile powertrain warranty. Coming around this, we can see that nice Denali grill on the front of this. You got your sensors, your LED lights, your cameras surrounding this one. It does have the high-definition surround vision camera system. Towing hooks up front. Our diesel, or excuse me, our Denali rims and tire package. Does have power assist steps. Right now they're in simply because the doors are closed. All of our GMC vehicles have proximity keys, so if you have the key in your pocket or in your hand, you just simply walk up, push that small chrome button right there. You can either have it defaulted for just that door to open up or all the doors will open up for you, depending on how you want it to work. So here's something that some people don't know on these power assist steps. You do have a button here on the back of it. You come up behind here, using your foot. So that power assist step comes all the way back gives you access to the front of the bed. So you can step up in there. Close that again, you just walk up. Touch it again and she closes for you. Multi-pro tail tailgate. We'll go through that in just a little bit. Dual exhaust. Power rear window. Spray and bed liner. Rear steps. Again, this is at 3.0 diesel. So just to point out, a little change from a couple years ago. The diesel is now next to the diesel gas where they put your def. It's not underneath the hood anymore. There's the outside of this one. Again, this is a 2024 GMC Sierra. 1500 Denali. Let's go ahead and take a look at the inside. Wow, as soon as we open up this door, that's definitely jumping out and telling you this is a Denali. Let's go ahead and uh, before we go through the things inside it, let's go ahead and talk about the, the standard and uh, extra options that were added onto this vehicle. So this has got the, uh, again, the diesel. So it's got the five-year, 100,000 mile powertrain warranty. It's got the GMC Pro Safety Package, so you've got the Ford Collision Alert, Front Pedestrian Braking, Departure Warning, Following Distance Indicator, IntelliBeam Auto High Beam System, Front and Rear Park Assist, Trailer Side Blind Zone Alert, Rear Cross Traffic Alert, Rear Pedestrian Alert, Safety Alert Seat, High Definition Surround Vision, the Tire Pressure Monitoring with Tire Flat Alert. This does have a trailering package, so it's got the trailer brake uh, controller that's integrated into it. It's got the GMC Premium Infotainment System. <coughs> Does have the in-vehicle trailering app, the Bose Premium Sound System, three years of OnStar Premium Plan, dual zone climate control, 12-way power front bucket seats, heated front and rear outer seats, ventilated front seats, power steering column, the rear seat is a 60-40 folding bench seat with storage package underneath it. Do have the driver seat and mirror memory package, LED cargo area lighting, spray in bed liner with the GMC logo, the GMC Multi Pro tailgate, 
The mirrors are power folding and heated. You got LED fog lamps, dual exhaust with premium tips. Options that were added onto this one, like I said earlier, this has got the Denali Reserve Super Cruise package. So you've got your Super Cruise, your Super Cruise steering wheel, rear camera mirror, multicolor 15 inch diagonal heads up display, power sunroof, GMC Multi Pro power steps, and the 22 inch painted aluminum wheels. Let's go ahead and take a look at the inside. All right, here we are coming to the driver's door. Looking at the driver's door, we see our memory sets for our mirrors and our seats. Opening up the windows, closing the windows, locking doors, etc. Got our Bose premium sound system. Floor package in this one. But it does have the rubber floor mats as well as the integrated carpet into the mat. There's our Denali labeling. Lower seats and lower lumbar. A shot of that sunroof. Behind the steering wheel, you've got options for changing the stations as well as the volume. Here's your power telescoping steering wheel. Up, down, in, out. Electronic parking brake. Options for your drivetrain, auto, two-wheel high, four-wheel high, four-wheel low, trailering mode. Numerous different options for interior and exterior lighting. Left side of the steering wheel is for the cruise control. Also runs the adaptive cruise control. Pushing that button will turn the adaptive cruise control on and off. Your distance indicator, which works with the adaptive cruise control, as well as your collision detection systems. Heated steering wheel. Right side of the steering wheel controls your Bluetooth phone. And then your rolling button and arrows here control your driver information center in front of you. So I'm just going to roll through some of those. So the sensor right here is the sensor that works with your Super Cruise. <coughs> and that's what watches your eyes and makes sure that you're paying attention. The steering wheel here, you'll see there's an LED light that's built into it. Um, that is what's letting you know what phase or section the Super Cruise is working in. Um, that changes from a blue to a green to a red, depending on uh, the status of the Super Cruise. Small A over here, this is for your IntelliBeam headlight systems. So that's set up when you have your headlights on bright and this system is turned on if it detects a vehicle in front of you, either the headlights or the taillights. Your lights will automatically dim down and then when that vehicle passes you, your lights will automatically go back up. Look at that premium infotainment center. Here's your radio system that's in it. You got AM, FM, you got XM radio, you got Bluetooth. Your mapping system that comes with the vehicle. So you're going to have numerous different ways that you can have maps. You're going to have maps from your phone. You're going to have maps from built into the vehicle. Um, and then you're also going to have the OnStar maps for three years. <coughs> Excuse me. It does have a trailering package that's built into it. So you can build different profiles on different trailers. Keep track of the mileage and uh, maintenance that you're doing on the vehicles or on the trailers. Here's your camera system. Let me get this system turned on. There we are. There's the high definition 360 surround vision. On the left side is the surround vision, showing it, showing it all the way around. The right side camera is controlled by the buttons on the bottom. The line on the top of this one says this is the button we're using. So we're using this button. The circle orange on top means we're looking forward. So this picture over here, we're looking forward. Now we're looking back. 
Now we're looking out of this one and we're looking straight down at the rear. Now we're looking straight down at the front. Now we've got our side options, side options to the rear, and that's how that system works. A really cool system. Lots of cameras and sensors all the way around it. Let's go into your settings once, take a look at our options that we have for the vehicle. So everything in this section here, <coughs> excuse me, can be defaulted and changed to how you want the vehicle to operate, how you want it to work. So as an example, collision and detection systems, you've got a full gamut of collision and detection systems in this one, including an alert seat. If that's something you don't necessarily like, you can change that, you can shut it off. You got automatic emergency braking and front pedestrian braking. Those systems are designed to minimize your accidents, not keep you out of accidents, but you do have the ability to go in. If you want to change them, you can go in and change them. These are heated and ventilated seats for the driver's side as well as the passenger side. Options for the steering wheel heater. Numerous options for the HVAC system that's in the vehicle. Your lane assist, park assist, remote start stop. So this vehicle does have the GMC remote stop start start stop system. So if you pull up to a stop sign and your vehicle is not asking for air or heat, when you come to a complete stop, your engine may shut off on you. Everything stays on except the engine. So your radio stays on, your light stays on, your fan stays on. Um, as soon as you take your foot off the brake, that engine starts up immediately. That system does default to being on each time you start the vehicle. If it is something you don't necessarily want on, you simply push the button and that system is turned off and, and working regularly. Manually dropping the tailgate, four-way hazards, traction control, downhill assist, button over here automatically rolls down all four windows it's auto window for four, four doors all right placing this one in park reverse neutral or drive simply putting your foot on the brake pushing the button on the left pushing the entire stick forward you're now in reverse you notice that high definition surround vision system turns on coming back to the drivetrain again we're still in reverse now we're just going to push the p button now we're in park, putting this vehicle in drive, again pushing that button on your left, pulling it towards us, now we're in drive. Simple as that, back in park. Here's your integrated park, your integrated brake system for your trailer. Here's your remote, locking the doors, unlocking the doors, remote start, dropping the tailgate. This remote actually also works to roll the windows down, you can have that option turned on for you. Got a glove box up top. You got one down below. Also got a nice storage in between the front seats. Wireless charging station. Electrical outlet. USB. Some more USB there in the middle. Let's go ahead and take a look at that second row. Oh, hold on before we do that. One more thing I need to show you up here. So this is the rear view mirror that turns into a rear view camera system. So right now we have it on normal. Simply reaching below it. Turns that on. That's now a camera system that we're using to look to our rear instead of the actual mirror itself. So our OnStar options. Opening up the sunroof, opening up the rear window. You have four garage or three garage door openers that you can program into it. You got interior lighting options. All right, now let's go ahead and take a look at that second row. All right, here we are coming into the second row again. That front seats are bucket seats, so there's two up front, and you've got room for three in the back. Another shot at that protective covering on the floor, the floor mats with the carpet insert. Rear seats have got some storage that's built into them. If you don't have three passengers in the back, you got a nice armrest with the beverage holder. Another 
shot at that power mirror power window looking into the back area there nice storage underneath heated seats in the back USB options in the back Go ahead and take a look at that multi-pro tailgate. If we come up to this, push the bottom button. Push the top button. Push that button down. There we are. You got it fully extended so you can step up in there one other option that i do like showing everybody give me one second to set it up so we've just taken what would be our about our six foot bed we've put the multi-pro tailgate into another configuration now you've made about an eight foot bed and you can put your two by fours or your four by eights uh, in the back there and you don't have to worry about them sliding out. So there we have it. There's another nice GMC pickup at uh, Larkin's GMC in Tomo, Wisconsin. If you're interested in this vehicle, go ahead and give us a call here. Phone number is 608-372-2161. Again, Mark Nicholson coming to you from Larkin's GMC in Tomo, Wisconsin, 608-372-2161.